In just about 100 years, they had given the country a new spacious shape. The enrollment issue originated with uh, when the government set up reservations. They signed up the Indians who were assigned to that particular reservation. They took a role, as it were, at that time. Everybody was given a number so that they could identify the people who were reservation-bound Indians because reservations and the inception were no more than glorified concentration camps. Indians were forbidden to leave them. And so you were given your tribal identity right then and there by the United States government. You know, when you, when you take prisoners, you, you write down their names and give them a number. That way you can keep track of them. It's a very simple process. It's done in every war. It's done in every... Uh, every time one group of people conquered another group of, another group of people. Uh, when I was younger, I was extremely angry about it, you know. Now, there's a sadness because things will never be the way that they used to be. It will never happen. So I just try and work as hard as I can to retain as much of my culture for myself, for future generations. But I'm never going to let them forget it. I think that one of my goals is to have our people look at themselves and stop dancing for white people and saying, we're so pretty. I want us to say, look what you've done to us. Look what you've taken. Look at the beauty we had and still have to offer you. We have lost so much blood and so many of us have died uh, over the main Indian. And so we've earned it. And we've earned that name with our blood.